It was actually a starter position, I would say, assisting people with visual impairment uh, as it relates to just being their support system. And from there, I started to move up within the government. And I'm excited that I actually took that initial step because at first when I thought of working for the government, it was scary. I was like, oh my gosh, am I really ready for this? But my mother really motivated me. I was like, look, this is a great opportunity. You wanted flexibility. You wanted to work from nine to five, no nights, no weekends. And prior to that, I would work two jobs just to get the weekends off, sometimes three, you know me, um, just to get the Friday, Saturday, and Sunday off. And when she presented that, I was like, okay, you know what? I'll look into it. Because at that time, I was a full-time entrepreneur, but now transitioning with family and all of that, I was like, you know what? Let me consider this to help bring in some income. And I'm so glad I did because now going on 12 years, working in the government, um, it's allowed me to provide uh, opportunities for my family that I'm not sure I would have been able to. Being a citizen, I should say, um, opened that door as well because that was one of the questions they asked, are you a citizen? And um, here we are today, 12 years in. All right, so the name of my company is called Training for Greatness. It's a holistic approach to professional and business development. So prior to going into government, I was in the entertainment industry, marketing, but what I found was that the struggle as far as that work-life balance was definitely hard. But when I went into government, it allowed me the freedom and the flexibility, even during the daytime, because there are certain government branches that allow what's called flex time. That's where you go in earlier in the day and you can flex about two hours midday to take care of what you, have, what you need to take care of, whether it's doctor's appointments, your personal endeavors, things with your kids, and you're not necessarily using your leave but you're just going in earlier and then you stay a little later and have that flexibility. So that really helped me in growing my business because it's difficult to meet with clients seven o'clock, eight o'clock at night, but I was able to meet with them midday to grow the business to where it is now. If you see those positions open up in government, don't be afraid, go for it. You know, you never know because now that stability helps to open up opportunities for family time, which many of us who are immigrants um, lack family time because we're working so hard in between jobs. You just get a chance to just eat a little piece of bread and, and drink tea. There's no time. There's family time when we retire, when even retirement is a different job.